one, two, three bars within the same minute here. So it, it, it may not be showing you, um, it, it may not be showing you any different of a story. Um, but going back to, to dollar yen, we're all over the place this morning, but busy markets. Going back to dollar yen, here's what we got. Or uh, not dollar yen, uh, yeah, uh, dollar yen. We got a potential harmonic move, ABCD pattern, coming right down here to 119.26. Bang. We've got 1618 Fibonacci extension, swing high to swing low, and back up. 1618, we dragged that out some to make it a little, uh, oops. Make it a little easier to see. One six one eight extension right there, and if we take our Fibonacci retracement from our swing low right here, previous support to swing high, we're gonna have a six one eight. So we got an ABCD pattern, we got a one six one eight Fibonacci retracement, and we got a uh, six one eight Fibonacci retracement. We may actually have another one down here as well. I think we're gonna be a little short. Yep, yeah, a little short. And of course, we have structure. So for those looking. Um, CTS traders looking to get short dollar yen, here's your next opportunity at 119.26. Now, do remember, we do have the cipher pattern as well, resting right below there at 118.93. So depending on how, uh, how far you're looking to place your stop loss, you may have to choose one or the other. Cipher pattern looking like this. Now, let's head down to one more time frame and, and see if we can get a, some day trading perspective on here. All right, so I'm long aggressively at 119.29. I got stops, um, one ATR below our low spike. I'm looking down here on the five minute chart. So my stops are down at 119.09s, 119.07s, right around here. Looking for a move back into this 119.50 level. So it's not the best risk reward in the, in the world. It's uh, just about one to one, a little bit more than one to one. Uh, but looking for a move back into 119.50s on dollar yen. Now, again, very aggressive entry here. Um, no double top or no double bottom, no lower low, lower close. Um, strictly going off candlestick formation and, and that spike that we got. So it's an aggressive trade. So we'll see if uh, we'll see if it pans out and goes the way we want. We've been watching this. We've been stalking this trade all day. Um, so it'd be good if we can get a winner off of it. Um, nothing worse than stalking a trade all day, you know, getting, you know, doing your IPDE, identifying, predicting, deciding, executing, entering the trade, and then getting stopped out right away. Nothing worse than that. So we'll see if we can uh, pull this one off. So I'll keep that in my, uh, my rear view mirror. Uh, Aussie dollar is still moving up into that zone. Again, I don't think we're going to see anything today, but we'll keep an eye on it. Hey traders, Akil Stokes here. Just wanted to give you a quick update on the dollar yen trade. Uh, we did extract some profits from the market. You can see the market actually rallied all the way up to about 119.65s uh, and we're starting to retrace right now. Now, an important lesson that we talked, we talked about a lot in the live room today. In fact, I got, um, I got a lot of compliments saying it was one of the best sessions we've had in weeks. And I'm going to save this topic for tomorrow's weekend review video, hopefully, but we talked a lot about being realistic with your expectations in the market. And this was a great example of it. You can see that we didn't get greedy. We didn't shoot for a move all the way back up to uh, 120s or 119.85s. We, we identified our next structure level. We, we knew it was a counter trend trade. And in counter trend trading, we're just looking for a little piece of the move, not a full reversal. So what we did was we identified our next structure level, did a little... Um, process a little game we called uh i like to call it uh think like the other trader we got our money out at that level um and then we got out of the market there's no need to get greedy we take what we can get and then we leave and you see the market did just that and actually it looks like we may have put in uh for some of you guys may have been actually a, a bat pattern in here as well nope hit the six point eight, so it's not going to be a bat pattern but another uh nope nothing here we just came to structure that's it uh so just want to update you on that trade. Nothing big, only about 20 pips out of it. But you know what? For a day trade, I will take that each and every day. And more importantly, I hope you guys are paying attention to the process that we went through. Um, although this trade was on a lower time frame, a five minute chart, you can do the same thing on 60 minutes, four hours, dailies, weekly. Um, it doesn't matter what time frame you're looking at. The movement is the same on all of them. Uh, so 
That's it, traders. I'll see you tomorrow for another weekend review video. Oh, if you like what you saw in this video, I know it was only a short recording, but if you like what you saw in this video, go over to our website, www.tradeempower.com and, and check out, uh, well, the tab just changed, but check out my Forex uh, trading live room. What I do is I offer a free one week trial. We have a great community in there. Uh, traders of all different levels. We have experienced traders in there. We have novice traders in there. And uh, it's just great to see everyone helping each other and, and trying to learn together in these markets. But go over to tradeempower.com, click the uh, top tab that says products and services, uh, head over to membership programs and go to Forex Live Trading Room. And once you're on that page, it'll give you a little information about my live room. But if you click this button to start a one week trial, you get to test it out. You get to see, hey, is this a place that's right for me? Um, if you're a trader that's looking to see how uh, price action structure, Fibonacci ratios, and of course, how advanced patterns are used day in and day out in the live market, it's certainly worth checking out. Also, if you're a trader that is, well, just a little lonely, you trade all day and you're, you're by yourself, you have no friends that are interested in trading, uh, which is often the case, and, and you just want to share three hours a day with like-minded individuals, it's certainly worth checking it out. Uh, so I look forward to seeing you in there. And until next time, traders, plan your trade, trade your plan. Best of luck in the markets this week.